What's going on, Slayers? We are in the final week of our Peachy Keen event, and we have eight new challenges. What are they? How do we do them? What is the most efficient and effective way to get them done as quickly as possible and get all the rest of our rewards? Which, by the way, if you haven't already gotten everything, this is the week that you will definitely acquire every last item. Anyway, how do we do it? What is the secret? I have all these answers and more. I'm Dark Shot of the YouTube Assassin. Let's get our Doom Eternal on. So as I said, we're in our final week of the Peachy Keen event. You got seven days to complete these, and let's check out the challenges. So quick adventure, complete any two campaign levels. That's 25,000 XP. Now, that does not count over on the right. The ultraviolence is the answer, which I'll get into in a moment. Coliseum Victor, win three battle mode matches, 25,000 XP. Now that's any three battle mode matches you have to win. Not just participate in, win. I know that gets difficult depending on what side you are, you know, who's playing against you or with you. It does get difficult, but you don't give up. You can do this. Arena Purge, win five battle mode matches. That's 25,000 XP. And again, that is just like Coliseum Victor. If you do all three of those, you only have to do two when they get here because they stack. Bone Saw, kill one Revenant with the Chainsaw. 25,000 XP. Now, again, I like to go to the final sin to get all these guys. I'm probably going to get them all there, and it'll be real easy. Ultraviolence is the answer. 25,000 XP. Complete one mission on Ultraviolence or harder, and that's any one mission. You got to understand Ultraviolence, then Nightmare. That's the way it goes. Uh, Slayer Recruit, win one match in battle mode. 25,000 XP. Again, Difficult, depending on who you're playing with or against. Showdown, glory kill, one marauder, 25,000 XP. That's really not going to be that hard. You do that normally anyway. Just shotgun the living daylights out of them, and then when they're weak, just glory kill them. Pretty simple. I usually kill them with the BFG. Sometimes it's hard, but this is one of the tougher enemies, and it's easy to do this. Bruiser, kill one baron with the blood punch, 25,000 XP. Again... That's really not going to be that hard. You just have to weaken it a little bit. Don't go for the overkill, and you'll be able to do it. Now, if you complete four out of eight of these challenges, you will gain 50,000 XP on top of whatever XP you already earned with all the other items. If you complete all eight, or eight challenges, then you will get 150,000 XP on top of the XP you've already gotten. So, I mean, you're looking at couple hundred thousand 300,000 probably better anyway I'm gonna go over to do a couple of these things and then I'll bring you guys in and the first thing I did was a level on nightmare which did not count for the other thing but this is the final sin and as you can see within the first five minutes we already see that we have a revenant we're just gonna get close to him he keeps running look at this punk here we go we'll chainsaw you and that takes care of that now, we just have to wait a few moments, and you'll actually see one of the Barons of Hell pop, and then we'll be able to take him out. We have to glory kill him. All you have to do is leave all the, I guess, zombies alone, all the, the little low-level characters, these nothing guys. Go for the imps, go for the gargoyles, definitely go for these guys, and all the other big guys, the soldiers, and eventually you will get that guy to pop take that guy out too here he is all right so what i normally do here is i go over to the heavy cannon and i start just tip a tapping him so that that way i'm able to like weaken him a little bit we'll do that just to get uh some extra blood punch ready and just run around the arena kind of like you know don't try not to take him out and try to really concentrate on him not the other enemies because that's really what you want to do and at this point, I should be able to blood punch him. But I went a little extra, which I really shouldn't have done. There we go. Now what you can do here is just uh, load the last checkpoint, and you've got him back again. And in this case, you don't want to make the same mistake. 
just weaken him. Uh, you know, if, if you have to go and, and use this heavy cannon on some of the other enemies so that you could build up the blood punch so you could get glory kill, that's fine. But there we go. I weakened them enough so that that way I've got that thing going. And now I'll take out the rest of these guys. And further up in this zone, we will find our Marauder. Here he is, in fact. And again, he's going to be... He's one of the toughest guys. One of the toughest characters, honestly. We're going to shoot him a couple of times. We're going to get rid of all this. There we go. Look at that. All we have to do is that... Now, I know a lot of people, I had just said that like I could kill him with the BFG, and some people don't believe me, so here he is. I'm going to kill him with the BFG. It's really not that easy. Basically, you got to catch him off guard. you got to catch him attacking you. Sometimes you don't even see that like you got him. I don't know if that was the barrel that got him or I got him. I want to say I got him because that usually happens where I get him like that. It's really, really one of those difficult to see kind of things sometimes i'm not even looking at him and he just dies because like he took that hit anyway we're at the end here and what we're going to do is we are going to uh check out what we've got as far as all of our rewards it takes a little while to come up so it looks like we've got well over what we needed Possibly like four or five of those things. And yeah, here we go. Completed the master collection for the uh, Commander Keen, which is pretty cool. And we'll take a look at what we've got here. We'll see exactly what's left. I'm pretty sure all that's left is going to be the uh, challenges for the multiplayer, which is not that bad. So here we go. Uh, look at me pressing all the wrong buttons. Got to get to events, obviously, then go over to challenges. Yeah, got everything there. And somebody else already is uh, one of my boosters already earned some stuff. So there we go. I've got five out of the eight. All I need to do now is the battle mode. And that'll put me way over the top. I'm going to do it anyway, just because some people have me as boosters. And I want to help you guys out. So that's all there is to this video i hope you enjoyed the video please like subscribe it helps this channel out an awful lot as always i want to thank each and every one of you for watching until next time take care be good stay safe take care of each other and don't forget to rip and tear